What's up guys? Welcome back to another vlog. Uh, <laughs> this is a crazy vlog, but wow. Uh, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, like, share, all those beautiful things. Um, I don't know where to even start. Um, sometimes things happen in life that catches you completely off guard and is so unexpected, so random, like a one in a trillion chance of it happening. And that's when you know for certain, without a shadow of a doubt, that things happen for a reason, that there's no accidents, that there's, there's no coincidences. Sometimes things happen that are meant to happen for a specific reason. And for me right now, I just bumped into someone that the last person probably on the planet that I would have ever expected to bump into and the last time I seen them would have been about four years ago or something like that and um, when the last time I seen this person um, it, it wasn't a positive situation and it did not end in a good way um, you know and I had spent for for a while I you know it was probably a matter of fact this might even been I guess it was maybe four years ago or something three four years ago I'm not sure anyways it was a while ago and um, the thing is I it didn't end in a good way and, and for a moment you know I it, it hurt me and it, it upset me um, the situation and everything that was going on at that particular time and it was, it was a lot of different things going on at once, but this particular person, you know, it, it hurt me the way things had turned out, and I, for a period of time, there was a period of time where, where I was upset, and I, I, I think I, it was a, just a natural feeling, you know, and I, I at the time, maybe even, I, I was, I probably disliked the, a lot of people, <laughs> maybe a whole island some would say <laughs> um, without going into details the details are important what's important though is that this person I just randomly in the middle of nowhere I was driving and I was didn't even know where I was and I ended up making a like u-turn even to go the other direction because I felt I was going the wrong way and I, you know, decided, like, I could have put in the map, like, where to go. I didn't. I was like, no, you know what, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna wing it, you know? So I, I just was aimlessly driving, which, me making a decision not to put a destination in my maps and to directly go there, again, another, just, the signs of, of, of the universe or God or whatever you want to call the force that you know, whether you're spiritual, religious, whatever, you know, I don't want to each to your own, but I'm going to say the divine power, the universe, God, they're all probably one and the same anyways, but depends on your beliefs, that's fine. But for me, obviously the universe wanted me here at this particular location, at this particular time, God wanted me here at this particular location, at this particular time, because I bumped into this most random person. I hadn't seen her in a long time. Things was just, you know, not not a great situation when things ended. Um, this friendship just evaporated very quick back at that point in time. And suddenly, <laughs> I'm, so I pull into this parking area and <laughs> At first I was even like, I don't know if I want to park here, there's probably a lot of mosquitoes, there's probably a lot of midges and stuff because I'm by the water. And so I was a little bit like, eh, I don't know. So I open the door and I go, I go, hey, so is there a lot of, I saw this, la this lady, I saw her over, um, and, and I saw her, this lady, I was like, hey, is there a lot of mosquitoes here? And suddenly 
she goes, Faith! And I was like, what? Like, and it didn't dawn on me that she was saying my name. It didn't dawn on me. It didn't register. I was, it was really, it was so weird. It was like, because I, I wasn't expecting someone to be saying my name, you know? And I, I, I kind of thought, Faith, like, oh, you got to have faith about the mosquitoes biting you, maybe? I don't know. And uh, come find out, it was this person from my past. And... I couldn't believe it. We both just was like, because of all the place, guys, I'm in the middle of nowhere. This is a random, like, small kind of park area um, where it's, I mean, it's an isolated park. It's not like a major city park or anything. Like, I'm in the boondocks, man. Like, I'm in the middle of nowhere, but it's beautiful. As you can see, beautiful water and everything is very beautiful here. But for me to randomly bump into this person that I haven't seen in a very long time, in a park in the middle of nowhere at this particular time when I could have been anywhere doing anything and all the decisions I made that led to me being here I can tell you right now there's, there's no coincidence there's no accidents this was meant to happen and the reason I know it because something beautiful happened that again unexpected but she gave me the biggest hug more than once <laughs> Just beautiful, beautiful hug, full of, you know when someone hugs you and you can tell if they really mean that hug, if, if it's something that they really want to do, you know, like you can feel that embrace, that that energy. You can tell, energy doesn't lie, man, and, and I could feel that embrace and I felt that that warmth and and then she gave me another hug after that hug and and she said, I've been, for, for a while, been wanting to just find you and all I wanted to say to you was I'm sorry and that caught me again off guard I, I wasn't expecting that I was never a million years expecting that she apologized she gave me another hug we we talked and the best thing is is that see if you guys know me I like to think I'm someone who I do my best to never hold grudges. I don't I don't want to hold on to that negative energy. I like to let go of that stuff. I don't like to to be that way and inclined. It's not by my nature to be that type of person. So, you know, I always do my best to to always be open to to people and and understanding that no one on this planet, including myself, no one's perfect. We all make mistakes. We all fall short. We all do things that later on we look back and we go, "Gosh, what what was that? Like, I don't even know why that happened that way or why I did that or this or that. And <laughs> it's it's such a it's such an, an amazing thing because I I had I felt no negativity, no anger, no I was I was not upset at her at all and I totally was open and I was like, you know, it's it's all good. Like it's in the past, it happened years ago, like it's all good. You know, and and I forgive you. You know, like I, I um accept your forgiveness. I, you know, I forgive you. It's fine. Everything is good. You know, it's okay. It's in the past. Let's move forward. You know, and we started talking, and and suddenly it was just it was very clear as to why this had happened. You know, and she told me you know, she had been carrying around this this guilt herself as well. And it was something that we both needed. We both needed, it was like an, an unfinished, like we never got the, a positive closure to this. It never, you know, it just kind of was this thing, you know? And it was festering in the background somewhere. And it wasn't until that moment that I even realized, because like I said, I, I try to hold on to negative things and, and when things happen in my life, I like to just keep moving forward. I don't like to hold on to that negative stuff and it but it came it became apparent to me that after we talked and after we hugged and and you know after she she apologized and all these beautiful things happened that subconsciously somewhere in the back I it was nice to hear it and maybe at some level I did need that because along the way that was part of a bunch of things that were going on that caused me to lose a bit of faith in in humanity it caused me to lose a bit of my um willing to to let people get 
so close into this little space again, you know, like, and, and I closed down. I mean, she'd asked me, you know, she's like, so, you know, like, she's like, are you, are you, are you, you know, with anyone? Have you, you know, are you, da 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 da, like those these different questions. And I'm like, no, actually, I, I haven't. I haven't been with, you know, I started just thinking about, wait a minute, yeah, I've been really closed, even though I don't think about it that way because I'm, I'm a very, I like to think I'm an approachable person. I'm an open person. I, I like to, to, you know, I'm a people person and I like to build rapport with people and, and connect with people and all those beautiful things. But there was a part of me that was, was a bit protected and guarded, you know? And I didn't really realize that until that moment because I was like, you know what? I needed to kind of hear that because part of me needed to still be reminded that there's there's hope you know that people that you know humanity there's hope you know all those things you guys have seen some of the vlogs I've done about humanity in the past and you know it tends to be you know every day you watch the news or you watch TV all these things it's, it's gloomy it's sad it's depressing there's always some negativity going on on this planet of ours and so every once in a while it's nice to be reminded that that there's hope and there there are genuine people and that we all in the heat of the moment sometimes do things say things that might be completely out of our character but circumstances or environment or the people around us help to to kind of turn us somehow because that energy affects us you know that energy if you're around an energy that's a negative energy and it's not a, a positive energy, it can easily affect you and start bringing you down and affecting who you are as a person. So, so I think for me, just this moment right now just reminded me, you know, and it was a beautiful thing. And uh, if you happen to watch this video, and I'm not gonna put anyone on the spot, I'm not gonna put any, you know, um, names you know who you are and um, I want to say to you thank you so much again um, I got in the car I was I was like I can't leave I gotta I gotta do this vlog here even though I'm getting bit <laughs> by a million mosquitoes now uh, I'm all itchy but I had to do it here because this is so significant so beautiful and I just wanted to say thank you and and I got none but love for you and and yeah it's it's beautiful when you can put all that stuff aside and move forward um, in life, guys, it's a beautiful thing. It's a, such a beautiful feeling. And I, if you guys are experiencing that yourselves, I, I really want to say to you, you to, to do that, give it a try. Just forgive someone. Just, just, if they come to you and apologize, just accept their apology. Just open your heart and just be willing to let the negative stuff go. I actually did a vlog on this. And I haven't uploaded yet, but I'm going to do that freaking day. I did a I did a vlog on negative attachments in your life and holding on to all that negative stuff and that clutter. And you got to declutterize. You got to let go of it. And it's a beautiful thing when you realize in your life that you know the universe, God has a funny way of working in mysterious ways, as as they say. And it is very true and sometimes you just can't believe what's going on it's like how could this happen like and it's beautiful because we're all connected in some shape form or fashion there's lessons to be learned in our lives and when we when we find that lesson and we learn that lesson we, we find that blessing as you guys have heard me say so many times so anyways I'm not gonna keep going on because I'll keep rambling now and I'll just keep really and I'm getting bit like crazy which if you can notice I am actually scratching all over kind of now with my feet and stuff so anyways guys this is this vlog I, I don't really it's caught me off guard I'm, I'm kind of still lost for words so if I'm a little bit ah, over the place um, yeah I'm <laughs> mind blown so much love to you guys remember to live each moment to the fullest remember to truly live each moment to the fullest and to to live with an open heart and big arms and 
and to love one another and to forgive one another and to to do, just do your best just to be a beautiful person putting off good energy good vibes because if you do you never know the universe has a funny way to make things right and you just got to keep the faith <laughs> um okay i'm going i'll uh, see you guys much love Thank you.